Yo, what is up guys? My name is Marco. Welcome to a new video. So a new fragrance came out recently from the Giorgio Armani's factory. It's a new fragrance signed by the Armani Code DNA, which is already a, one of the most successful fragrance by Giorgio Armani. And I think that this, will, this is gonna be a really good fragrance. The name is Armani Code Absolute. Oh my god, Armani is making such a mess with these names, <laughs> I don't really understand them. But these absolute versions are coming out like are coming out for the Aqua Di Gio versions for the Armani code. And basically they add spiciness, they add a little bit more oriental vibes to the original fragrances. By the way, this Armani Code Absolute is a different version of the Profumo, Armani Code Profumo version, which is the most concentrated Armani Code fragrance, which means it's the, it, it, it is it's supposed to be to last longer and to be more powerful. And by the way, I have it right here. It's, this is the Armani Code Profumo. Profumo means, as I told you, it has more fragrance oil than the Eau de Toilette and the Eau de Parfum. And basically it's a sweet, sophisticated, still really seductive uh, fragrance for men. I think it's most suitable for nighttime, evening time. I use it when I go clubbing and it's so powerful guys. But by the way, what's the difference between this fragrance and the absolute new version? I'm gonna tell you cause I found it on Sephora every time as always and I tried it, tested it a little bit and see the difference between this one, the original one and also the new one, the absolute version. And I'll tell you what I think about the scent, the performance and the compliments. So what about the scent? I have it right here. It's really good. It's really, really, really good. I think it's almost better than this. I like it most than this because it has so much sweetness inside here. That's why it's perfect for, uh, for clubbing time for, because it smashes all the other fragrances. But this one is still sweet and sophisticated, but it, it has a little bit less sweetness, which is substituted by oriental vibes, spiciness, a lot of spices and woody notes you can feel the woody notes. It's a little bit more masculine if you if you want to say it about that. But it's really, really good. I think if I would buy it right now, maybe this is a little bit more useful because you say, okay, this is perfect 100% for nighttime, well-dressed man, sharp man, sophisticated, but you want to be sweet because you want to grab attention. So this would be, I think, more useful. But the other one, I think it's better for the scent but I think I'd give it a 8.5 out of 10. So what about the performance? Like the original Profumo version, which is this one, uh, it's a sillage and performance monster. It lasts like the whole night. If you spray it before going out in the evening, you can smell it even on your clothes, moreover on your clothes, when you wake up the, the morning after the night. So, guys, it's really good. <laughs> I never, I never smelled it like that good before. I tested them and I saw that they pretty much last the same. Like the Profumo version and the Absolute version last the same. I think about on my skin, even eight, 10 hours, but practically the whole night if you go clubbing. So I think that for the performance, it's a monster like the original one and it's a nine, 9.5 out of 10. I think nine out of 10. And what about the compliments? I didn't have that much time to try out compliments, but I can tell you something. It's not that different from this one. So if a fragrance um, noob, like somebody that doesn't know that much about fragrances comes out and try them both, I think that he will not be that able to see the difference, to smell the difference. But I can tell you that with this fragrance, I received so many compliments, compliments and I think that with this new fragrance, I could receive like the same amount of compliments or even more. 
I think that as this has a great potential. By the way, I told you it's just a little bit more masculine, so maybe you can wear it more in the evening time, even uh, dinner time, and it will not uh, attack other people that much. And another thing I can tell you, I have my fragrance collection right there, and every time somebody comes in my room, I I ask them, I ask him to try out the fragrances that he wants to to like the most. The, and maybe he smells like Dior Sauvage, because it's very common, he smells like Spice, Bon Victor and Rolf. And every time somebody comes in and try out fragrances, they say that Armani Code Profumo, this one, is the best one they like the most, is the one they, they like the most. I don't actually understand why, maybe this has a very particular DNA, which is mass appealing and that is so masculine that it's really likable. And so I think that with this new Absolute version it would be pretty much the same. So I'd give it a 9 out of 10. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this review. I really like that fragrance. I give it an 8.5 out of 10, like I gave to this one. It has great potential. Let's see how it works during time. And I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe and I'll see you next week. Peace.